Today is August 17, 2014. I blew a hydraulic line in the excavator. Not a big deal. It costs about $40 to fix, but it's Sunday and I can't get that fixed today. So, change of plan. Today we're going to do a back burner project. We get this rock here. It's so big that I can't move it with the excavator, but it's got to come out because it's blocking the driveway here. So I rented a, a hammer drill. Here's my generator. And we're going to use a product here called EcoBus. Where is it? Here. Okay, so here's the EcoBus product. So what you do is you, you drill holes, then you mix up the compound and you pour it into the hole. They have to be one and a half inch thick holes. And this thing has a compressive force of 20,000 pounds per square inch. So this is, this will break this rock. Yeah, so you can see over there with that rock right there, it puts cars coming really too close to that, uh, this other big rock that's going to stay. So uh, I want Want to be able to swing the road a little bit wider here and that rock's got to go so that's what we're going to try to do today i think a nice new drill bit last time i did this it was really dull and it didn't work at all okay i got seven holes drilled in line on this rock Put that well chunk lighter I drilled a, a long fault I got these rocks down here put some holes in these too I'd really like to break them up they're not that important but uh, it would be better if they were gone so I'm gonna head down to another rock down below and drill that while I got the drill okay I got all my drilling done I drilled six holes in in this rock it's uh, again too big for the excavator to pick up. So now it's time to uh, mix up the eco bust and put it in there. Now we get the stuff all mixed up. It's a matter of putting, putting it in the holes. Now we get 10 minutes and uh, you know, we'll start the setup. It takes full 24. 24 to 72 hours to, to set up and break the rock. Get it poured. So, uh, looks like just perfect. Just uh, one bag was just enough, exactly enough to fill up six holes. So, all we have to do now is cover it with a tarp, let it cook. Apparently, this stuff gets pretty hot. And uh, the reason they want you to use a, an inch and a half inch hole is because uh, if it's bigger than that it, the heat could cause it to blow out so in any minute we cover it with a tarp and then come back in a day or two and, and uh, see what we got This is great news. I have been vindicated. My wife said this EcoBus stuff would never work, but it did. I missed one little note in the directions. It said you need to let it set up for 24 hours, yet it will continue to expand for up to 72 hours. So after uh, I came up here after 24 hours and like nothing happened. But now 48 hours, we can see we've got a nice crack right through here so basically all the four rocks that i drilled actually cracked and i got so excited uh i came up here with the excavator earlier and i pulled it apart <laughs> just to make sure that it really did work so you can see right here from like here's there's one of the drill holes look at that the eco bus just turns to powder afterwards Twenty thousand pounds per square inch of this stuff look at that it's just powder now Busted that rock right in half. Cool stuff. That was pretty, uh, pretty big rock. It was uh, several feet thick. Well, let's see, two at least, three foot thick. We're gonna go down. We'll take a look at the other rock. So here's the other rock I was trying to bust in half. Well, the, obviously, the uh, eco bust didn't <laughs> break it that far. It only put a half inch crack, but big enough that I could just tug it with the excavator, and the whole thing fell apart. Uh, pulled apart like this. So you can see where I drilled here. Look at that. Eco bus, all powder right now. Okay. You can see the drill holes here, and on this side, 20,000 pounds per square inch. Enough braking horse to bust this rock right in half. That's some great stuff. 